Hello everyone, thanks for joining me today on the Shine the Light 73 channel. Today I'd like to bring to you something that I came across in an interview I was listening to that really puts a light year into perspective. If you've ever watched anything on the universe or read any books on the universe, they toss around the term light year like you're just supposed to be able to understand that dis the distance. I mean, the distance is unimaginable. It's such a long distance that you know it, it's hard to put things in perspective so I heard something that kind of puts it in perspective and it's really quite profound and interesting tidbit of information um, I was listening to an interview by Santos Bonacci he had a man named Scott Onstott on uh, American Freedom Radio on the show that Santos does and he said that the relationship between an inch and a mile is the same to 99.9% .9 accuracy of the relationship of an astronomical unit to a light year. Now, at, at first, that may just like, okay, <laughs> whatever. But if you really think about it, you know, we know that the dif distance between the sun and the earth is 92,960,000 miles. That's an astronomical unit. So, you know, 92 million miles, that's quite a distance right there. But that would be your inch compared to the mile, the mile being the light year. Now, I never even thought of that before. I never heard that before. No one ever put it to me like that. I mean, all that I ever used to think was that I knew 186,000 miles per second was the speed of light. So, you know, light could go around the planet seven and a half times. The planet's almost 25,000 miles in all the way around. So, seven and a half times, that's how fast light traveled in one second. So, you know, that's incredible amount of speed. But, Anyway, I just thought that uh, I wanted to share that information. That's just really incredible. The, um, I mean, the, the interview with Scott was quite thought-provoking. He has did a lot of talking about numbers and different relationships, uh, different perce processional numbers, and numbers that reoccur over and over again from ancient times, measurements, and different things. So, it's, uh, one thing that I got out of that that I'll share is that the speed of light is 299,792,458 meters per second, which happens to be the exact latitude of the Giza Pyramid on the map. It's 29.9792458 degrees latitude. So that just kind of blew me away right there too. So 